doing an unboxing of Wizard Fafnir Hypersphere with Gatchet? Ratchet. Ratchet, yeah. And Rise Hypersphere. And I just love how big Wizard Fafnir is. He's just like the the Dakarotomi GT. He is really big. And I just love this, you guys. I, I was hoping this would be big because I like big Beyblades because it's a lot heavier. So they can't be pushed around more. Uh, and the drop down time is 2. And whenever it rides the rails, it's 4. For whenever it rides the rails. Yeah. Okay. This is stamina. Okay, I'm trying to get the stats. Okay, there's the. How did I leave the lid on the table? Here's the rip cord. Okay. Here is Wizard Fafnir. There it is. Wizard. Man, it looks so big. There's the yeah. code for it. It is big. It's really big. That is awesome, you guys. And I don't know if it spin steals. It does have a little bit of grooves. Yeah, I bet it's like my guy's back here. Yeah. It has plastic, but the grooves help it spin steal. Of course, the fact is. that it's left, man, too. Here's Ratchet. Nice and shiny. That is just awesome. And hopefully it spins this way right into the spikes. Okay, I, I still want to know if this absorbs. Okay, no, it does not. It does not absorb. Like uh, there's tips. What is that? This part of the tip. Okay, let's put them together and let's feel the slopes. Oh, that is. An... It's like. What? Okay, some nice slopes. I think it's left spin. Mm -hmm. It's left spin. I was expecting to be right, but this thing is like. Super light. Alright. Well, let's see what it looks like in action. Okay. Do a couple test spins on it and then we can battle it. Ace Dragon Solar Sphinx is what we're going to battle it against. Here's the second one. Okay, now let's battle Solar Sphinx against. You want to give it a test pin first? Yeah. You got it in the left? No. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, Fafnir will always be left. Okay. That's a movement on it, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But I didn't spin it fully because my I have big hands and this is a tiny launcher. Alright. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that landed perfectly. Who are you going to battle against first? Ace Dragon. Ace Dragon? 
Yeah, I'm gonna spin Wizard of Fafnir first, then Ace Dragon. Uh, I'm just gonna get this little trip right. I'm just dropping everything. Okay, spinning Fafnir first. Fafnir. Fafnir. I think Fafnir can spin steel. I think he spins steels. That's how we won that. Okay, I'm gonna do another battle with Ace Dragon. And then I'm gonna do it with Solar Sphinx. hits. I swear, these these hypersphere, they they just pull out, just come at each other, just literally hard hits non-stop. Spin stealer. Yeah, near again. Yep. Spin I've stealer. It. I've seen that. Spin stealer. Little damage on Ace Dragon. It was like right there. Okay, I really think Fafnir is an awesome bay, especially if someone hits these grooves hard. That's definitely going to make it spin really fast. And guess who hits hard? Yeah, this will be interesting. Yeah. We timed we timed Ace Dragon and Solar Sphinx's time. As Ace Dragon's time was 39 seconds. And Sphinx time was a minute and 50 seconds. Okay, left spin. Right spin. And Solar Sphinx is attack type. So he is a really heavy attack type. Oh! Like I, told, like I told you guys, Sphinx, he does take hard hits. Yeah, he does. Uh, that's that's probably Fafnir's weakness. It's hard hits like that from Sphinx. Ooh, okay. I could barely put that together. I'm trying to put it in right. Okay, one more battle with Sphinx. Sphinx launcher. Fafnir launcher. Fafnir just keeps speeding up. Fafnir, I think I got that one. Wait, wait. Draw. <laughs> Draw. Okay, Fafnir got that one for sure. Fafnir is the winner of that. I just love Fafnir because he can spin still, he is big, and he has lots of stamina. And if you guys don't have the Wizard Fafnir Hypersphere, I would prefer you guys go get one because these things are awesome. Thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, like and subscribe to our channel, and keep on spinning.